Zillatal Rucksack Route is a circuit of some 80 kilometers, starting and finishing at Meyerhofen in the Zillatal Alps. Over 7,000 meters of ascent is involved over several steep passes. The Zillatal Alps are a classic mixture of rock and ice and are amongst the most demanding mountains in Austria. There is also much greenery in the forests and the lush alpine meadows. These meadows are laden with carpets of flowers. Effervescent streams gush forth from the glaciers. The route usually takes a week or more, with optional extra days for the summits. The relatively modest distance involved belies the physical effort required. Although the route involves no glaciers, it does cross several high passes and snow is a very real possibility. The trail crosses several extended boulder fields which can prove awkward, particularly in the wet. On many sections of the trail, fixed wires and ladders are used to ease the passage. There's no technical difficulty as such, but the second day can prove extremely awkward under conditions of snow or heavy rain. In these conditions it would be very easy to slip and you'd go a long way. However, any reasonably fit person will manage the Zillatal rucksack route quite comfortably. Nine-year-old Ben managed the whole tour without too much trouble and carried his own rucksack throughout, even in poor conditions. I'm fine. Good. The route is marked by red and white paint marks, but in the event of thick mist or snow, these can be hard to follow across the boulder fields. There's nowhere to stock up with provisions en route, so you have to take everything you need for the whole tour. Having said this, don't take lots of food as I did. You can buy everything you need at the huts. The food is generally of a very good standard, but for a vegetarian like me, it can be a bit limited. The huts tend to serve regional produce, and we certainly ate our share of Apfelstrudel. Breakfast can be somewhat disappointing, with the regulation two pieces of bread and one cup of coffee. But that's not always the case, and unless you want to lump all your food round with you, you don't have a lot of choice. The huts are a great place to relax after the rigours of a day's walk. Bergsteiger Getränk is a bit like Ribena, and it's very refreshing. The huts are varied in character, but they're all comfortable, most with showers and individual beds. The Berliner hut is particularly magnificent. Some of the huts are denoted as suitable for children, and Ben certainly enjoyed himself. Even on the bad days, there's enough to entertain. There are many possibilities for day excursions from the huts. These usually involve crossing a glacier, or some element of technical climbing, albeit of a fairly low standard. There are some fine peaks, including the Löffler, the Mersler, and the Alpera. The Grinberg Spitzer is also a good little mountain, and it makes a great way to end the tour. By combining these mountains with the circular tour, the Zillertal rucksack route will leave many happy memories. Can you see the view?
a great game. <laughs> Quite a backdrop there. This is the top of the opera in a really good climate. Really enjoyed that. Mm, damn the hatch. Magnifico. Cheers! Cheers. Cheers. <laughs>